Nice little kick ball and the stay down. And the shot from Ferran Torres is blocked by the body of Travers. And Ferran Torres could have opened his Manchester City account there. Doyle keeps it alive and finds Walker. Made the burst. Good play, it's brilliant from City. Deserved a goal at the end of it, and Riyad Mahrez is denied by Travers, who makes his second save in what three or four minutes. It's a lovely move, isn't it? Incisive and decisive almost. And Riyad Mahrez hits it crisply. just before the season unfortunately came to an end but now a chance for City to open the score in which they've taken and it is that Mandelap what a way to announce yourself as a first team footballer terrific finish it was by no means a formality and just as I was talking about the fact that he had a couple of little injury problems but returned fit and well just before the season came to its premature end in March He's right on cue with a sumptuous finish, which he made look simple. It wasn't simple, it was missable, but you wouldn't think so when you look at it from the replays. And look at the smile on Pep Guardiola's face. He's seen him play for the academy, for the under-23s, for the under-18s, and City ahead. gifted players outside of the Premier League Brooks and he showed it there and eventually the equaliser is turned in by Surridge well City weren't ahead for long and Surridge who has only really had one opportunity in the opening 21 and a half minutes has now found the back of the City goal it's a good throw as well the shot isn't bad either well Rodri took it hit it and almost scored it. Travers threw himself up towards the top corner. He's in the captain. It's adventurously and a second time. And Rodri. Mahrez has got it all wrong. It's a good position actually for Riyad Mahrez. Hence his disappointment. Rodri had clobbered in two shots at the Bournemouth goal. Both were blocked. Simpson and off a board. And Surridge is onside and Stefan with the legs makes a very, very important tackle. If he'd have got that wrong, he could have been sent off. He didn't get it wrong, he got it right. And it was a really good sliding tackle when City needed him to be the sweeper keeper. Brooks again with a beautifully weighted pass and that is excellent goalkeeping from Zach Stefan. Here's Mares meanwhile. Gets the return and hits the base of the post and it's in on the rebound. And would you believe it? What a night for Delap. Oh it's Foden, I beg his pardon, not Delap. I thought it was Foden, not Delap, but the camera went with Delap and threw me a little bit, but it was Foden that put it in. And having scored on Monday at Wolves, Foden has now done the same tonight. And has he provided the winning goal and our City into the fourth round of the Carabao Cup? Phil Foden on target after Mares had hit the base of the post. Seven minutes of added time has almost elapsed. City can clear this and then surely that will be it. It will. Well, it's been a struggle, but City have done it. They've found their way through another Carabao Cup tie. Liam Delap with a wonderful, wonderful goal on his first team debut. Gave City a first half lead, which they didn't hold for long. Surridge equalising. And although the Blues did not have too many chances in the second half, once 
Pep Guardiola brought on Kevin De Bruyne and Raheem Sterling and the two moments did start to emerge and after Riyad Mahrez hit the base of the post Phil Foden helped the rebound over the line and City are through to the fourth round of the Carabao Cup.